Hello, folks. 24th of December, Christmas Eve. I'm having fun here with my son. Yeah, he's out sporting. Maybe we'll shovel some snow. And I will go to the garage. I wasn't here for two months. I was, I had no motivation, gentlemen. No motivation. It was too cold. Ah, but I said maybe my bikes are missing. So what's new? Karma, Karma is all done. She's waiting. What is a family bike? Family FLH is without a gearbox. Gearbox is missing simply because it was leaking like hell. I, in my opinion, I fixed it. I put all, all new seals, uh, blah, blah, blah. And uh, I, I, I rode first time. It was in the late autumn. It was leaking like hell, maybe 100 grams per hour. Yeah. So, uh, so I, I took it apart and started checking out and fi found it out that actually it was leaking through this hole, through this stood hole, you know. There was a two, three millimeters hole. Stood went through the case. So what I did is I used uh, this liquid weld or cold weld, whatever you call it. Yeah, put all these four places, glued like epoxy, you know, glue. So now what I did also here, so um, I ordered from Canada, from one guy named Ray Dugway. He, he, this guy is making at home, uh, uh, what is bearing race. And what is special about this race, it has a groove, groove inside with the, with the O-ring. And that O-ring actually seals uh, the main issue, uh, you know, on the fourth gear, leaking. So, very nice guy, ships very fast. Uh, I think he has ready made those, shipping very fast. Very, I would say cheap and good. good. So I took two, one for, for this family bike and another for uh, my, another project bike. Over here, 1992 frame. Actually, half frame without the without the bottom rails, but I will use these bottom rails from this frame, so I will weld it two together. Uh, another reason, uh, yeah, while I while I took apart the gearbox, uh, uh, my wife said she gave me ultimatum, you know, just to change the open primary back to the standard primary because she could not stand the noise of the of the clutch, you know. Uh, on the prime open primary, she said that she thinks that the motorcycle goes apart, falls apart, and everybody's watching at us at at the supermarket anywhere. This strange sound, you know, of the clutch. So she said, "No, no, no, she's not gonna ride with me." So I said, "Okay, no problem. I will change it back to the uh, wet primary, and I will use this open for that project." Yeah, also I put here now some uh, some uh, bond. I don't remember the name of that. But I, while it was curing, actually, I was uh, fixing or checking my friend's shovel head heads. The reason why we took it apart was that uh, we found when it was smoking like hell, no compression. And we took it apart and we found out that there was no seal on, uh, on the valves, no seals. I don't know, was it on, done on purpose or no? So what I did now, I just, uh, of course we cleaned it out, everything, and it's not clean and nice. So I put a seal on and look what's happening. I thought that maybe it's uh, too little uh, space here for a seal, so it will actually be touching by, by, by moving uh, uh, moving spring or moving um, valve. So what I have now there is about four to five millimeters, maybe five millimeters gap. So please, anybody who could comment me, is it okay like with five millimeters gap there, four or five millimeters? How, how deep this valve is going in and out, in? So it will be okay or it will be touching or interfering with the... Anybody please comment me. So I think it should be okay, it doesn't go so deep, you know. 
Yeah, so that's, uh, that's about it. What I'm doing here. I would like to finish this during these uh, holidays here. Now this uh, gearbox, I have everything there in place. I will change, all gears are okay. I will just change the few bronze, uh, what's the name of this bronze? Bushings, bronze bushings, you know. Yeah, otherwise, more or less all okay. And, uh, ah, by the way, I can, tell you a few findings if you want if you're interesting which i think uh, yeah this is uh, mm, first gear first gear uh, dog you see how it was done i think somebody machined that originally i discussed with the uh, andrews they was must be equal like like square but it was like you see it's very nicely it's not done by by wearing and tearing it's done by by machine but it, that's supposed to be square, you know. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to just change, move, move, change it direction like this. So I think it will be like this. One thing, and another doggy, I think it was put in in the incorrect way. From, if looking from the top, like this. It must be, you see, it, mach it is machined, it, it, look, it should look north, how to say. And in my case, it was put opposite. Actually, I did it myself four years ago. Maybe I did it wrong, I don't know. Perhaps it was me. So now I will put it like this, in a, in a standard way. Yeah. What else I have here? I have a new press. It's a Christmas present for myself. I had no press, now I have it. I'm very happy with that. Yeah, that's it. Thank you very much uh, for watching. Uh, wish you very, very nice and warm Christmas with your families. And uh, Happy New Year. And, and uh, see you later. Thank you. Bye-bye.